The use of fossil fuel isn't the only driving mechanism in greenhouse gases. In fact, a major contributing force, something as high as 50%, is our food choice specifically as it relates to eating animals. It's taking away most of our land, it's affecting most of our oceans, it's taking away our water systems, it's essentially taking away habitat and creating pollution, world hunger, and creating climate change more than any other factor. We have a culture that is falling apart. Sterility is rampant. More and more couples of reproductive ages are basically sterile, and it has to do with enzymeless nutrition and consuming all this processed food. We're born knowing how to take care of ourselves. It's called instinct. We have a gut reaction, but we've forgotten because the way the world is set up, the way the world is so bizarre, the way the world is so chemicalized, by using more chemicals to correct the imbalance, we're actually causing the imbalances to be even stronger. The love affair, the romance, that has kept us to such a strong bond between us and plants, we've ignored that, and we're paying the price now. When you consume slaughtered animals, you consume the fear and the anxiety and the stress, they are in a state of panic. The panic attack of the slaughtered animals comes into your body. There are a lot of different dietary theories out there, but I think one thing is kind of indisputable. Having a diet that is rich in whole plant-based foods is truly a great way to get you to good health or to kind of balance your body. There's such a stigma, I guess, that people just get automatically turned off and just assume that it's gonna suck, but it's like it doesn't. To me, I think food just is way better this way. I would say just try it. You know, you'll surprise yourself. The cause of most of our diseases and the cure is within anybody's reach who gets the knowledge. The problem is, is they have to make some change. That's a small problem. Everywhere I go around the world, there's not a single person I've met that doesn't know that fruits and vegetables are good for them. We all know it. It's not about the knowing, it's about the doing. You can expect artery disease to stabilize and reverse and the symptoms to go away. You can expect the type 2 diabetes to be cured 100% of the time with diet change and associated weight loss. You can expect the arthritis to improve and go away and be cured. And I know that it sounds insane that food could do that, but it did. It completely changed my life. When you reboot, when you give your body this nourishment, this nurturing of plants, you sort of come out of the valley and you go up the mountain and boy, you love the view. There's no money in doing the right thing. There's money in selling you blood pressure pills, powerful arthritis drugs, laxatives, antacids. That's where the money is. The truth is the solution is free and within your reach.